peace to all. Oh, except for Mike Evans right now. Have you ever wondered how they harvest cranberries? Well, let's find out. So they take the water from the ditches surrounding the fields, which are supplied by the local dike, and they pump the water into the field itself, and that releases all the berries from the branches and they float to the top. And then they just scoop them into floating nets and bring them into the corner and pump them out. Pretty simple. So this is what they do. They fill the water into the field. All the cranberries float to the top. They go out there with several sections of these little, I don't know, six inch maybe floating nets. And they corral all the berries into a corner. And then they bring in the uh, big vacuum truck. Suck her all up. It's pretty interesting. Neat colors here. This was shot in 4K originally, but YouTube only has 1080p and the video editor I use really sucks, so a lot of this is lost, shamefully, but that's the way it is. I'll be quiet for a while and just let you check it out and see what's going on. So as you can see they work in groups of smaller nets and smaller nets and they corral all the cranberries into the corner and then it's basically like a gold dredge. They put the big pump into the water, suck up the cranberries, goes on to the dredge I guess I'll call it for lack of a better word. You can see on the dredge there, it actually separates the greenery, which is useless to them, from the blue blueberries, excuse me, from the cranberries. The greenery drops down into the truck, and the cranberries go along the conveyor belt and dump into the hauling truck. And they dump it in fast. We'll get a little aerial here, and wow, you can see them pouring in there. It didn't take long to fill this truck up at all probably about a half an hour or so. The other thing to notice is as it's sucking it up, again it separates the greenery, and the water goes back into the ditch, the cranberries go into the truck, very effective, very uh, cost efficient. I wanted to see how many berries come off the plant using the water because after talking to the workers they told me when they flood the fields that's it they don't go in and beat the bushes to get the berries off pick them anything they just flood it 
and that's it so I was wondering how many berries do they actually get and as you can see they get them basically anything below the water line they get if there's anything above the water line a few berries survive there but as you can see not very many at all yeah so that's basically how they do a cranberry harvest interesting hope you enjoyed the video check out my other ones on my channel r sampson have a good day